So uh, we've got another lockdown coming mm -hmm. on Thursday. Sad times, but uh, kind of expected it. But so what we've done basically this week, just gonna get everyone having fun, maxing out if they want to. Um, and today I'm here helping Emily, who's maxing out. Um, so she's gonna, you know, hit her lifts that she was basically gonna hit in the TSM comp, the strength room comp. comp. And yeah, and, <laughs> and win the comp. So. Yeah. Uh, we postponed that until February, so that'll be good uh, whenever we do hold it. But yeah, I'm helping her max out today. I'm not gonna train. I think if I train, like, you know, I've got that nervous energy for her, because obviously like, she's my girlfriend, I care about what she's doing, so I've got that nervous energy, so I, I don't wanna focus on my own session. I'd rather just do that like tomorrow. Um, but it's been amazing so far. People have done well, my clients doing well. Just had Rob here pull 500 even pounds. <laughs> even Konfuki, even Con Fuckrad. Um, you know, pulled some filthy deadlifts, yeah. <laughs> Strolls up to 175, and then what else did you do? 185. 185 yeah, yeah. Phil, Phil, the deadlift king, boy. <laughs> cool, but yeah, that's the video. Um, and that's yeah. what we're gonna do. I've got this sweet new tee from SVD Apparel. That's cool for the world's strongest man, which is still apparently going ahead, so hopefully it will. No spots, apparently. She's too strong and big. I'm redundant. What's that? It's so smart. Come on. Absolutely, on the fact that I feel emasculated. <laughs> Absolutely. 100%. Are we going to go through here? Oh, fucking hell. You're a bodybuilder now, Nathan. You're not meant to be maxing out. No mixed grip bullshit. No, <laughs> I don't care if I have to hit shit. Yeah, you're fucking just pulling it. It doesn't matter what you do. I want to see one, 172 would be a PB. Yeah, yeah, it would, yeah. So Emily's done with her max out now. Uh, she's being a bit of a bint, so she's a bit grumpy about what she hit. But that's because she sets very, very high expectations for herself, and she's super stubborn. So you know, if uh, if things don't go her way, then she's very stubborn about that. But she lifted some insane numbers, uh, and I'm super proud of her. So it's really good to see she's done that before lockdown. Obviously, we got a home gym, so we can continue training at home. Um, and uh, go on, yeah. <laughs> that was a PB over there, awesome. Um, and uh, yeah, so we're looking forward to that. I obviously didn't train today, I'll probably train tomorrow, so hopefully, maybe Conrad could be here, I don't know. He's got a night shift, so we might be, uh, might be asleep. <laughs> but yeah, hopefully we'll get like a video out, maybe sometime soon of me doing some stuff. If not, then see you on the other side. Hi. Uh, welcome to the garage again. Got some good kit in here from uh, building up stuff that I bought for strongman training and obviously in like last lockdown and stuff. Um, Emily and I were training at home a lot more so got a few bits from here. A few of these bits I won in like giveaways and a couple of other bits just picked up along the way or friends have lent me which is amazing. Um, but yeah built up quite a nice little collection just uh, just so that I can train at home you know it's the one thing I 
I care about a lot, so I like investing in it. Um, and yeah, just uh, feels good to be able to train. Weather's pretty nice at the moment, even though it's cold and it's winter. It's still really, really I mean, this nice. This is like so. the fucking heat wave. Well, yeah, winter will get for the UK, much. this is great. Yeah. Yeah, five degrees, like, yes. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to go through some events, have some fun, and uh, see yeah. what we can do. yoke from uh, Sussex Strength Store which is cool um, really good bit of kit it's so easy to put together which is great and I got the 60 I think it's 60 kilos because it's just easier to put together like the other ones like 125 on its own that would not be a good time um, but this is perfect gonna use this for the comp um, whenever that happens <laughs> and uh, yeah it'll be really good because it's nice and easy to switch with the pins and stuff but definitely uh, excited to give it a run out today and see how we go Lights in the back of the car. Yeah. Like. <laughs> oh shit. That's cool. So um, done a little uh, little bit of yoke, got up to 220, which is nowhere near a PB. It's like 100 something off, but obviously I'm not trying to PB every week, just trying to get my body back into it. Obviously it's the first time I've used that yoke, so I was just aiming for a bit of speed. You know, see how my knee feels, feels good, feels solid. My rehab is working already. I've been going at it aggressively, so I just got to keep that up. I'm going to make use of this loading platform, which you'll see in the video that's about to go on now, um, that Pete Colborn made me, one of my clients. Legend, him and his dad like built this uh, platform that I'm going to use for like loading and stone lifting and stuff, which is so so cool. Just out of scrap wood, so what a legend! Thanks, Pete. Um, and yeah, just going to do some keg and sandbag onto it. Just nothing crazy. I've done like 125 kilo sandbags, but today just going to stick with the light one, about 70 kilos and 50-ish for the keg, and just uh, sort of work on fitness more than anything. Perfect resting platform. Thanks, Pete. <laughs> yeah, thanks, Pete. <laughs> That's what it was built for. That's tough. Feels weird in the cold air, like. Yeah. But then it wasn't enjoyable in summer either. <laughs> I can't be there. <laughs> can't win. <laughs> Your um capabilities, like drift in and out, like you can almost 
peak up your strength on loading stuff and the fitness side of strongman. Um, you know, like I did like a 120 kilo bag or whatever with Bish and, and uh, Terry, or no, I think it was heavier than that, and it felt easy. But that might have just been a good day, you know, a bit of adrenaline from like being pushed by them. But yeah. today it's more like maintenance kind of thing, you know, so. <laughs> That's harder than you think. Is it hard? No, that's fun. Thanks, Pete. <laughs> Thanks, Pete. <laughs> it's gonna be like the new thing. Thanks, Pete. That's hard. What the hell? I'm meant, I'm meant to be good at grit. Oh. One fuki. Go. That one's tired. <gasps> what the hell? And again. <laughs> the deadlift king is back. That's it. <laughs> Me and Comrade just uh, <laughs> chatting shit. Um, good session overall, good sweat on. Um, just getting back into some events uh, for some lockdown training. Um, really happy with this platform. Thanks again, Pete. Thanks, Pete. Um, but uh, yeah, had some fun on the yoke, did a few squats. Feel really good, my knee's feeling good. Yeah, no complaints really. Um, thanks for coming, Comrade. Got beaten on the grip. <laughs> yeah, got beaten on the grip by Comrade. It's just embarrassing. Everything hurts. But uh, yeah, come back next week to hit it up and uh, see you guys soon, I guess.